So how do shopping carts actually work? And what exactly is a merchant account? Let me introduce you to Frank. Frank has been looking for a special gift for his girlfriend Jenny. So he looks at various online stores and finds the perfect thing. He's just got to enter his credit card details on the store's shopping cart. But wait, he thinks, how do I know the site's secure? You need to look for evidence that the online store runs on SSL, which means Secure Socket Layer. This means that the information is encrypted, like code, so no one can read what it says until it's unencrypted. If the website address starts with HTTPS, that S on the end means it is an SSL secure site. OK, phew, well that's good to know. So Frank can safely fill out his details knowing that his information is secure. Once he clicks the Buy button, the details are sent to the payment gateway, which processes the information to make sure everything it needs to continue processing the transaction is correct. It then determines which company manages Frank's credit card and sends a request for the card to be charged. Frank's credit card company validates the card and the account. If everything checks out correctly, the credit card company sends an acknowledgement back to the payment gateway that the amount requested can be transferred. If the credit card company denies the charge, it sends a code back to the payment gateway indicating what the problem was. The payment gateway now tells the shopping cart at the web host whether or not the transaction was successful. The payment gateway initiates a settlement request to the merchant account company for the credit card to deposit the funds into the store's merchant account. Internet merchant accounts collect funds from thousands of transactions and then schedule transfers to the store's own bank account, thus completing the process.